Hey guys, what's going on? It's Yoanti. I got a brand new sneaker unboxing for you guys. Uh, outside right now, it's actually getting a little warmer. Sun is coming out. Snow is slowly, slowly melting, but it feels nice to be outside. I'm going to start doing a lot more of my videos outside. I've been cooped up for far too long indoors, so let's go ahead and get into it. I literally walked up to my doorstep and these were sitting here. And based on the box, it reminds me of... Uh, one that I got just the other day. So I'm going to crack them open uh, just to confirm that that's what it could potentially be. Uh, if it is, I'm very excited because my last pair I'm obsessed with. So here we go. Uh, let's take a look. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Hold on. Saucony box. Here we go. Now, I, I feel like it's going to be, uh, let's see. Yep. It's another Courageous. So as you know, there's four colorways. Links in the description are all four. Maroon, blue, gray, and olive green. So uh, I already got the maroon. About to crack these open. Oh, yes. It's the ones I really like. Here we go. What's your prediction? What's your prediction? Because I wrote an article on UNT.com about how I couldn't decide which four I liked the best because they're all so good. But there were two in particular that I really liked. Three, actually. Uh, but here we go. Whoops. Crap. Boom. The olive joints. The dirty martinis, if you will. Here they are. Who? The, I'm telling you guys, 100 bucks. The suede for $100 is unbeatable. It's collab suede. Like, I'm going to do a comparison video to my Ronnie Fogg New Balance 530s. The suede on those compared to the suede on these. I think these are actually maybe better in for just a hundred dollars. So uh, it's the Courageous model. That's the name of the model. A lot of people have asked about sizing on these. Um, this is actually a size nine. My other pair is an eight and a half. I could go either. I'm going to try the size nine on to confirm, but uh, most Sockneys I can go eight and a half or nine. They both fit really good. I prefer eight and a half just because I like my shoes like snug, I like my toes, <coughs> toes right up against the toe box as long as there's no pinching in there. If there's no pinching, then I like that, um, you know, form-fitting shoe. Uh, sometimes when there's too much movement in the shoe, it just feels like it can just flip off at any moment, but these things are sexy. Uh, orange hits on the back, uh, kind of off-white cream color, little 3M hit on the back. On this part, the Saucony logo uh, on the sides is actually suede, whereas the maroon pair, it's like, a, I think it was like a leather. Uh, and then you've just got that plush green suede all over the shoe, uh, black outsole. So honestly, you, you can call these the Dirty Martini, uh, Courageous Dirty Martinis. I really like the way the Saucony Courageous logo looks on this too. It looks really cool the way, the way they have it and Saucony stitched on the back. So overall... Uh, beautiful shoe. Shout out to Saucony. Big shout out. Thank you so much. Um, link is in the description if you wanted to get a pair of these. I highly suggest branching out. Get out there. The sun's out. It's a new day. Try out a new brand. You'll be happy. You can't complain about quality. Oh, the quality is quality of that. You want quality. You want suede. 100 bucks. Do it. Uh, as always, guys, thanks for watching. Uh, hit the thumbs up button, subscribe, follow me on Instagram and Twitter. All those links are in the description. Check out your empty shop. Check out your empty.com. T-shirts, stickers for sale, all that other crap. I'll talk to you guys tomorrow. Take care. Peace.